Dark in night. Hey there, doll face. Interest you in a preem BD? What do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers, no washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch, it's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? Know what? Uh, maybe another time. Sure thing, doll. Reconsidered, huh? Bespoke? Damn, that sounds promising. I get it, I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, doll. Welcome to Lizzie's. My, what a sweet little face you have. Pretty doctor already. <laughs> no surprise there. All depends what you're into. Maybe you... Hey! Get you something. So, curious. The name... Lizzie's. That the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Oh, now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Girls were paid right, insured, even had decent security. Good spot all in all. Nah, stories of the golden days. Inevitable demise and the inevitable drink over sweet memories. All what makes the tall tales easier to swallow. So, what went wrong? Tiger Claws shot up Lizzie. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad once. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. Gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big boss now is Susie Q. The sign stayed up, out of respect. And biz booms to this day. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh-huh. So, Evelyn. 
Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Scents on. Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Mind if we talk about the job? Heard you got something for me. Mm. But not here. Come with me. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. So, what can a horn girl wrong. like me really? do for a hunt? Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just told you. Okay, here. Whack. Maybe electrosex. Zappy. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Let's talk biz. I mean, it's nice, but I didn't come here to get my ego stroked. No, you're here to gain some knowledge. The life-changing kind. Well, now you got me all excited. Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul, Trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Classy Corp Hotels? Mm, yeah, no. How to my price range? Hmm. Oh, the decor's to die for. As you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What, so Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? How jacking off to in those boxes? No. It can be a very useful tool. Good for oh, so analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp. Exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? 
Mm hmm. BD Rec implant. Why, you object? No, not at all. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Hey, there you are. This is V. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna make me barf. Impressive looking setup. Need all this to process brain dances? Mm-hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <clears throat> Judy. All right, all right. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside? Let her look, let her rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? What do you mean by raw? How's this differ from the ready-mades? Huh. Ready-mades, provided they're well-made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass-market shit, so it's pre-crafted, hard-coded, fenced-in, and manageable. A raw one? Well, it's more like a virtue in Viro. Get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Gotta create your sensory profile first. Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still, look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm hmm Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we... Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. And we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in. <laughs> Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, 
everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Down, everybody, on the ground. I want to see you kissing the flooring. Money, now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God. Whoa, yeah, uh, hey! Uh, now, before I blow your fucking head off! Ah! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. A flash of. Intense shock. I can still feel it. I, I remember. Fuck. That last second. Could have warned me how much it hurts to die. 